Do you ever feel like you just don't fit in? Like maybe something's missing? I do. <laughs> Hi. Hi. I'm Dave. I'm Dave. <gasps> Together, we're Dave, Dave and Dave. Dave. And we're here today to talk about connection, connection groups. Wait a minute. Connection groups? What are those? Well, I'm glad you asked, Dave. A connection group is an incremental unit that provides fellowship opportunities to its members. Uh, okay, you're using a lot of big words there. Well, let me put it to you this way, Dave. Connection groups are the way that individuals here at Crossview fellowship with one another, pray together, and grow deeper in their relationship with God. That's unbelievable. Believe it, Dave. <laughs> now, do you remember when God said, be fruitful and multiply? I do. Well, nobody took that more seriously than the Hex and the Yoders. Oh, they do have a lot of kids. Whoa, that's not what I was talking about, Dave. Oh, sorry. The Hex and the Yoders have a connection group that was so popular that it multiplied into a new group led by the Kimball family. Okay, I And know. that group was so popular that it multiplied again into a new, new group led by the Rattans. That's unbelievable. That's right, Dave. Now, I'm sure you're asking, what if I'm the type of person who's young at heart but loves to have birthdays? I was just thinking that. Then the plus, the plus connection group is for you. The plus connection group? Who are they? The plus connection group meets every Sunday morning over in the community room right before service. Oh, I've seen them. They look like they're having a lot of fun praying and talking to each other. They are having a lot of fun. And you know who else is having fun? Who? The College and Career Age Connection Group. College Age Group? Oh, you mean those kids that are just out of high school but haven't quite started a family yet? You nailed it, Dave. Oh. Now, the, <laughs> I bet you're asking yourself right now, what if I'm the type of person who likes good food friendly people, and the smell of dog food on Friday nights. Who doesn't? Well, then the Souter Connection Group is for you. <gasps> the Souters have really knocked this one out of the park with their unique fellowship opportunities and sharing one another's burdens with the love of Christ. Oh, that's amazing. Is that all? No, oh, no, Dave. <laughs> Are you the type of person who hears the word outreach ministry and thinks donuts? I was just thinking about donuts. Well, then the Kof group is for you. Kof. Kof? The Kofs. I know the Kotches. Well, yeah, see, that's the same people. The Kotches and the Kofs are the same people? See, we're making connections. I'm such an idiot. Yes, you are, Dave, but here's the thing. The Coves are really dealing out a hot hand for anybody who's interested in becoming part of a Crossview Connection group. Oh, that's just incredible. It sure is, Dave. You know what else is more incredible? What? If you call Bob Heck in the next 15 minutes, you'll get this wonderful t-shirt. While supplies last. While supplies last. Now, don't miss your opportunity to become part of a Crossview Connection group. And, and get, get connected. connected.